Frost fired out that handball. Mitchell couldn't get on the end of it. She clever. The timing yeah. from Jones was absolutely superb, and so was the finish. And he has. Nash a couple of cracks at it. And there's that pace and zip that Brockman offered. He was too good to get back on the inside. Too good for Foley. Watches it come back, which it does. It deserved a goal, and he got it. Sicily considers. Fairly congested in the front half, as you'd imagine, by now. But he found a, a little gap, and it was beautifully weighted for Dylan Moore. Day is everywhere at the moment, and keeping them guessing. Off to Warple. Big fly from Kaczynski, but yeah, Foley stood his ground. And Meek, but tailed off. Oh, boy. Weddell's got an opportunity for a second, and he takes it with absolute glee. Both fists clinched to celebrate his second. Ooh. Bit of a scramble, but kind for Nash. Now Reeves might be able to use his height, or Kaczynski coming up at the ball. He'll get a second opportunity for his first goal. This to widen the gap to 25 points in the opening turn. And that'll bring a big smile to the face of Jacob Kaczynski. He's in a hurry. Lewis got it, yep. Came to ground with Jamison, Waterman and Jones to the square. Allen beautifully back back, just work back off flank. Just at the right moment. Jack Darling's actually not bad at that. He's obviously not playing today. The pace injected from Mitchell. Charging forward, Seamus Mitchell. He wants a third action, but instead, McKenzie might squeeze it through. No, the fist was late but effective. Or is it a goal? It is. Fresh airy. Butler's hands were shut down. Jones face to face with Sam Butler. So Jermaine Jones broke his nose last week. It's accidental head clash. Reeves hooks it back. Day just lagged oh. the kick short. Oh, Edwards left it there. But ah, got it through somehow. Something like a handball out. Aim on into the don't argue. West was there to beg to differ. And that's a great follow up tackle from Sicily and follow up words. Aim on onto it quickly. Was wrong sided, so he chose McKenzie. Butler looking for a second, no pressure, he delayed it. And now Kaczynski for a second, which he'll really relish. They're rubbing it in now. Seized on it, already has a bounce. Charging forward, trying to energize. Got a clip. Frost has reported. Allen's gone back to the goal square to get his breath, and in case a kick comes in quickly from here. Looks like it might be headed Hawthorne's way, although Butler ran aground and the Eagles are able to fire it forward. Sheed, instinctive blast towards the goal square, and he's got it on target. Welcome reward for Dom Sheed. Frost needs no invitation. Brockman's had one already, and now a second, a third bounce through centre half forward. Brockman, Lewis should and does in the square. Edwards at a significant disadvantage. Little corridor opens up, and now the big corridor is there for Impey to kick quickly to half forward. Butler, play on, play on. Bruce screaming for it, but he decided to go a little longer and a little wider. And Mitchell Lewis strides on with an opportunity for a fourth here. He's a unique player. Other than if you count Jimmy Steins as a midfielder, yep. most of the others have been not in the thick of it, have they, in the midfield? So that's to his credit. Yep. And so is that. That's a fourth. Bramble had to let it bounce, which meant Hoff could close. And he did that well. But Bramble found a way through. Kelly took it from West to Hoff. Jimby took a step too many. And Butler will be rewarded for all of that. Brewster snuck out the back. The kick was shallower than that, as you saw. And Lewis got taken a little high. Wasn't enormous amount in it, but Bazo with the infraction. For a fifth goal for Mitchell Lewis. Couldn't have split them much better than that. Fired it back, Bramble. Just chipped it up. Meek Edwards did well to defend. McDonald. McKenzie, Warple, almost close enough. Now he is. Cool. 
That's drives hard. through another for the Hawks. We understand the, the options have been limited for Oscar. He hasn't had any service. But when the 50-50s have been there, Blanks held his own. Here's McDonald again, Red. relishing this opportunity that he, he was given a little early. More played it into the 50 to Luke Bruce. Now he can go. Got what he needed from behind from Bramble. Unrestricted access to the forward 50 for Lockie Bramble. Wrestle is on with Edwards and Lewis. He went to ground. Butler. Feeding the handball in that time, Lewis. McKenzie just put it on the boot. Knew exactly the angle required. Sam Mitchell talked about uh, just need to have a win. The players need to be able to sing the song and, and then eat a guilt-free hamburger. <laughs> so it could be quite a fun post-match for the Hawks. It's really, there's very little resistance. It's trying. It's got there. Started left, but it came back when it needed to. And Brockman, who might be able to get a third goal here once he exhausts all the... But, oh, no, he doesn't. He does use one of those little options. Oh, oh. And the juggler from Luke Bruce. Plus victories in Tasmania previously. But they find themselves with a triple-figure advantage here as Bruce kicks his third. And that experience from Bruce off to Newcomb. Hawthorne attacking again. Lewis back with the flight. It bounced a couple of times. That didn't hurt the cause. Six goals for Mitch Lewis. After a three and three in quarters two and three, he's got nine. Ten, in fact, to start with his eight. So he's, at, uh, he's finished off well. Newcomb. He, too, got himself clear. The siren is going to sound and ring out for a massive afternoon for Hawthorne. A 22-goal outing to get off the bottom of the ladder. The Eagles without a goal to show for the second half. And you can see what is ahead for the Hawks in the years to come. A 116-point thrashing of West Coast. Lastly on Mitch Lewis, the ability to see a beacon fall of the football, which you've struggled with at times this year. He hasn't played the whole year, but it must be pleasing, particularly someone like yourself coming off the half-back line. You've got that big guy in front of the footy. Yeah, he's helped us out so much. He's become a really good leader for us as well. He's got a good presence, and uh, all you really need to do is lock, look, lock eyes with him, and um, he'll give you a good contest. So, Mitchy Lewis, uh, I'm sorry, Luke Bruce and Lockie, not Lockie, but Tyler Brockman are happy to have him in the side, getting some soft crumbs and opportunities. So, uh, great. We'll let you go enjoy the song. Well done. Thanks. Sorry for rambling. <laughs> <laughs>